Hey guys, Ed here, you're on my channel, Blood, Fire and the Pillars of Smoke. This is the second video which I'm making about wings, okay? There is this thing I called my Holy Wings Trinity. And um, yeah, last week we've started with sweet, hot and sticky wings. This week we're doing something a little bit different. It's gonna be raspberry and balsamic glazed wings. Yep, sounds weird. You're gonna love this, trust me. Very simple, only five ingredients. Let's get started. We have some wings here. You can see this, right? They are already in a V shape. I told you about that bit. Now, in order to make these wings, what we're gonna need is five tablespoons of raspberry jam, two tablespoons, a little bit more of balsamic vinegar, lemon juice, this is about juice of half a lemon, about two tablespoons. And one uh, teaspoon of uh, chili flakes. You can use cayenne pepper. It's just for the heat. I love it hot. You can completely skip that if you really want that. That's pretty much it, okay? So, first and foremost, we make the glaze. We take the raspberry jam. We add the uh, balsamic vinegar. Just like that. We add the lemon juice. And eventually the chili flakes. Right now we grab a whisk and simply whisk it all together. Start, starting slow, but then see, this is all nice and combined. Okay, glaze aside, let's deal with the wings. Now we have to check the wings to make sure they don't have any unnecessary parts. So if I'm grabbing this, you see it was cut a little bad by the butcher. That happens when you buy wings in um, supermarkets. So I'll put this piece aside, I may grill it separately. What I'm going to do now, I basically will um, check each and every one. And once I'm done, I'll start working on the seasoning. To spice up these wings, we're gonna use this rub, which is called Clocking Hell. This is from uh, my friends in Heavenly Hell uh, Rubs and Sauces. I really love this. It really works charm when you want some real spicy chicken, okay? So, very simple. Just sprinkle on top, quite generously, I love it hot. Then I'm simply mixing it like this to make sure they're all covered. Giving it a little bit more spice. Just like that. That's pretty much it, okay? The wings are spiced up. Grill's on already. We'll start grilling in a, in a few minutes. The wings are ready, okay? Grill is hot enough. Let's start. As usual, putting the wings on the grill, on the skin side, because that's the fattier side. The wings are on the grill. I'm going to grill them about 20 to 22 minutes, flipping three times. Five minutes, flip, five minutes, flip, five minutes, flip, and then another five minutes. And during these last five minutes, I'll show you the magic of the glazing. It's been about 15 minutes. I'm ready to turn the wings last time. I'm ready with my glaze, okay? So, you can see how nice they look. We turn them. Okay, ready to glaze. Here we go. That's my glaze. Brush. Let's rock and roll. I'm not trying to put too much because when I will be taking them off, I'll simply add some more glaze on top just to make it look and taste much better. 
another two, three minutes and we'll be taking them off. Five minutes by, we're ready to take them off and I know they are ready because 20, 22 minutes for rings is more than enough on a medium, medium high heat, all right? So. These are my raspberry and balsamic glazed wings. They're absolutely great. And the last touch I need to do is all these remaining glaze. I'll just brush like this all over it. And don't worry, it's not gonna be too sweet because you remember that the underlying layer of spices was quite hot. It was the clucking hell, right? So this sweetness will only mask it and make sure that once you guys taste that the very first you will feel a nice fruity sweetness of raspberries but then you're gonna get a kick and that's what's cool about these wings <laughs> 